This is a Boogaboo B, and today we're going to show you how to remove the back wheel from the Boogaboo B. Uh, this is useful if you need to clean out all of the hair and string that has wound itself around the axle and is now preventing it from turning well, or you need to replace ball bearings that have become faulty, uh, or you need to replace the wheel itself. Uh, in relation to the back wheel, there are these teeth that uh, are a part of the brake system and these can get ripped up and so on, in which case you'd need to remove the back wheel. So now we're gonna show you how to remove it. You need two screwdrivers. It's the CRV4 head. It's like a hexagonal head and you'll need it on both screwdrivers. And you're just going to unscrew the axle. This is the uh, B plus, as I said, and this is process is the same for from models from the B plus and forwards, but the original B has a different sort of axle. Uh, it's like a cap that you have to pop off with a flathead screwdriver. So then it would be different in that case. I'm going to remove the axle and then push it through. There's washers on both sides of this, so don't lose them. And we can pull out the wheel, and remove the hair and string that has wound itself here around the lip of the ball bearing. Oh, the ball bearing came out with it. This can be a little bit of a difficult process. So uh, if you need to remove your ball bearings uh, in order to replace them, then um, this is how you do it. Assuming that it doesn't just pop out, you'll need a flathead screwdriver. You just stick it in the hole in the middle and then you can pop it out that way. Okay, reassembly. You press your ball bearings back into place. And then take your wheel and put it back in the fork. Make sure that the teeth are pointing inwards, as again, they are part of the brake system. Slot your axle through. Slide it all the way in. Make sure that everything lines up, it finds its hole and so on. Like this, and then you can screw the cap back in. There's that washer. Just screw it in tight. So, that's how you do that. Hope this video has been helpful. If it has been, we ask that you subscribe as it helps us to continue making videos in the future. Thank you.